Hey guys, what's up? So I recently went on a pin training adventure at Disneyland with the family. So I had 20 Tinkerbell pins and I thought it'd be a great idea to, to take all 20 pins, put them on a sash, and try to pin trade with people. I have a little video that kind of shows, uh, you know, the pin training adventure and then just our, you know, adventure at Disneyland that day. My experience though, this was my first time pin trading and uh, it was a lot of fun. It is actually pretty cool because it was a way for me to kind of like connect with people. Now granted, I only really traded with one person and uh, I ran into him a couple times in the park. I met this guy, Ben, and it was funny, we were, we were actually um, going through the, you know, the security checkpoint. While we were in line, I heard someone and saw him kind of like out of my peripherals and I was like, oh, that person has a sash too. Oh, that's pretty cool. I turned around to look at him and this guy was like, had a vest on like from top to bottom just filled with pins. And later I found out that that vest was actually like 23 pounds of pins. So we were in line and, and we are just kind of talking. I was like, oh, well, that's cool. And I, you know, I kind of mentioned, yeah, I brought some pins to trade to and all that. And, and he's like, oh yeah, you know, they have different values. You know, you always want to look at the back and see what they're worth and make sure they're real and all that. So yeah, we were just talking this and that. And then, you know, he had to go through the thing. So I, I, I was watching him as he was coming through because I was waiting for my group. He's like, gave the the security guard his vest and he was like hold this you know keep don't let it get messed up and the guy was like oh okay and he's like holding this vest making sure you know it doesn't fall on the ground and and so uh, as as we were leaving we saw him and i was like oh where are you gonna be he's like oh, i'll be in the park somewhere i was like okay we'll try to find you so next thing you know walking through the park i hadn't even gotten to put my sash on and there he is Ben is uh, already kind of like got his stuff laid out, but I walked up and I was like, hey, how's it going? And let me show you the Tinkerbell pins. And he, you know, I think he thought I was kidding when I said I brought just all Tinkerbell pins. Um, he's just like flipped open his book. He's like, whatever one you want, just tell me which one you want. I'm like, okay. So I think right there we probably traded like four or five. And so um, then we went out and did a bunch of stuff. What did we do? Oh, we, we hit Fantasyland. We did a bunch of Fantasyland rides. I ran into him again as we walked into Frontierland. There he was outside. Um, there's a store like right next to the uh, um, shooting arcade. So at that point we traded like another four, I think. And there was more that he had, but I, I kind of wanted to continue the experience on and find other people to trade with. You totally got ripped off, man. Those Tinkerbell pins were worth a lot. What, little Jay, you weren't there, you don't know. So here are all my favorite pins that I have. Um, this includes the new ones that I got on my pin trading adventure. I want to get a couple more on here, and in order to do that, I've got to do one thing. I'm gonna have to go as a pirate princess. I, I don't plan on looting and stealing any pins, but I, I think I'll, I'll try to trade some of these. So Ben, um, I don't know if you'll be there the day that I go back. I don't even know what day I'll go back, but if you're there, I've got some sweet pirate pirate pin swag right here. I don't really care about um, limited edition or anything. I'm just going for the aesthetics. If I like the pin, that's what I want. Now that might sound like a foolish man's last words, but that's the sword I live and die by. Oh, um, real quick, I just wanted to thank everyone. Uh, we just hit 700 subscribers uh, this past weekend. It just, it's really cool to like make something and and be able to like connect with people. I don't do this full time, but I, when I do get to do it, I enjoy it. So and I just wanna thank everyone, uh, everyone who, you know, has believed in me and supported me and uh, who's helped me get to this place. And I, I really appreciate you guys, every one of you. And uh, I hope to, uh, um, continue to bring smile to people's faces. So thank, thank you guys. Cheese it's ripes.